that of the ten best-selling books of all time, seven of them happen to be Mickey Spillane uh, uh, written. Now, how many books did you write? I wrote seven. Well, <laughs> what was the altercation you had with this gentleman who was uh, really uh, irate about oh, that? Oh, he was, he was interrupting my lunch, and he kept saying that it's a terrible commentary in the reading habits of the American public. You know, to think that a person like me would have seven books in the top ten bestsellers of all times. And I said, finally I said, I said, shut up, you're lucky I didn't write three more. <laughs> so, the whole story is because he doesn't. This is the point at the very end, which you'll see. Uh, oh, have you got a different line up here, Joe? I mean, a different uh, camera? One, one shot of him, okay. Well, now I have a copy of the deep here, and guys, two hoods, before they get a chance to draw, he shot, uh, shoots both of them. He doesn't kill them, but he shoots both of them. Now, now that's not very realistic, is it? Well, I'm going to tell you, I'm not going to answer this question for one big reason. You can't justify this until you finish the book. And you didn't finish the book yet. And I'm not going to give you the answer because it'll spoil it for you. Okay. But he's, in other words, there's got to be some reason why, logically, he can pop two of these uh, That's gunmen it's before they can It's justifiable in this case. Okay. Now, how do you just, I'm going to put on my Cotton Mather suit now. How do you justify making a hero out of a guy like the Deep, who is... Uh, well, I'm not going to tell you. You didn't finish the book yet. I didn't finish the no, book. No, I will. This now...